guys, so it's me Shiraz here, and today I will be doing five beauty tips and tricks for you guys, because you guys are like not as fabulous as me, and like I know everything about being fabulous and beautiful and like just perfect. So the first thing you want to like um, execute is to like get a partner, and I was going to use my Shelly. But, like, my shoe is too valuable and precious. So, like, I got this guy. I found this guy in the nursery store. And, like, oh, like, come over here. So, like, this is Derek. And he will be helping me today. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Shelly. Wait, but I don't know what I'm doing here. Oh, well, that's such an easy question. You just gotta lay down and here we go. Okay, so now that you have a person to do it on, or like you could do it on yourself because you're nasty. So my first tip is to use baking powder instead of foundation because you can never be too white, honey. So I have some right over here. Then you just want to apply it like everywhere. You should probably use your fingers to like apply it so that it gives the natural look. Just keep applying until you have something that looks like this. Oh yeah, and it's okay if you get some in your eyes because like that'll just uh, make uh, that'll just like add to the effect of like the natural yeah. <laughs> My next tip for you is to like to get more of a natural look, just use dirt instead of eyeshadow. It really gives the Shiraz feel, which is amazing. Uh! So I have some dirt over here in a bucket. And then you just want to apply it with your fingers so that like it's more natural. And you want to apply it all over the eyelid. And yeah. So just go ahead and do that. <laughs> just keep applying and just like never ever stop. Like never stop and just keep putting it on <laughs> until you get something like this oh yeah and it's okay if you get it like all over your face actually it's like totally better if you get it all over your face that way you know you're covered in eyeshadow and you can never have too much eyeshadow next we're doing my favorite we're putting some lipstick on but instead of using lipstick just use blood and let it dry so it's crusty to give a really natural and deep red look just like my lips <laughs> it's great isn't it so you just gotta get some blood i have some in this little tray so I actually have um, both fresh blood and I also have dried up blood. So then you can really see the difference and how it makes it look very lush and crusty and just fabulous and perfect and beautiful. <laughs> Anyways, I'm just going to apply that. So you just want to get some, oh, it's so sticky. When you have sticky blood, you know that that's the best. Okay, so take some blood on your paw and then put it all over your face or your person. Just like keep on going until you get something like this. Uh, I love it when I get the blood on my paw. It just feels so nice and refreshing and I love the coldness to it. Okay, so now my fourth tip is to like do your eyebrows 
But what you want to do is to use a permanent marker instead of actual like eyebrow stuff uh, to fill in your eyebrows so that you don't have to redo them every day, you know? Then you can save some time and work on your other beauty and outfit stuff. Ah! So just keep putting on your permanent marker until you get something that looks a little like this. Of course, yours will not be as good as mine, obviously, because I'm amazing and you're not. <laughs> but just keep going until you get something similar to this. Uh, talk about eyebrows on fleek. I know, right? Ah! Okay, so your eyebrows are the most important part of your face, obvi. And you need them to be on fleek. So I suggest following my tips for um, the permanent marker. That way you can do it once and never have to do it again. Oh, I'm getting so excited because Derek is gonna look like a superstar when he goes back in, out in public after I uh, um, wake him up. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, so my final tip for you today is to like, just like put baking powder all over yourself because you can never be too covered up with uh, your foundation. Well, actually it's baking powder, but you know. <laughs> so just uh, put it all over yourself. Just remember, you can never be too like concealed because you know, we all know that you're not perfect. Ugh, not as perfect as me, but so you just gotta cover it up. You gotta cover up everything. All of your flaws, all of your insecurities. And then just don't stop. Don't ever stop until you look like this or something close to this. Because you know you're not that good at makeup, just say. Your makeup is never on point. <laughs> so you better look like this. Oh, I love that. Love this look. So natural. So that's about it um, for my tubes. <gasps> and today I will wake him up hopefully um <laughs> oh Shelly. do you mind coming here for me Shelly? <coughs> oh my little baby it's time for your feast <coughs> So today, um, I am done for today. Uh, that's the end of my video. And, oh, I have one additional tip. If you're just too lazy to, like, put any makeup on, um, and if you're, like, not as perfect, if there's no way for you to, like, become as fabulous as me, or nearly as fabulous as me, just put a paper bag over your ugly face then all you gotta do is just put a paper bag over your ugly nasty crusty face and then you'll be beautiful <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe and like and comment um yeah bye <laughs> oh yeah and i forgot to tell you i killed derek <laughs> Hey guys, so thank you so much for watching. Click down there to watch our previous video and click over there to check out our social media. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye!